guys we are back in free code camp work working on that free web developer certificate we're in our basic algorithm scripting the bonfire find the longest word in a string so this one should be a little f uh, familiar with what we did beforehand so if you remember they, they give you some hints here so dot split will split up your string based on whatever separator you put in it. In this case, we want the longest word, so our separator would be the space. So that's a good place to start. So why don't we say var, and we'll say, um, we'll say var, what do you want to name it? We'll call it array, because it's going to become an array, so we'll call it array of strings, is equal to the string that we get split up with spaces. So we just created an array of strings, so uh, the zero, zero 01 would be the 1 would be the 1 index would be quick and so on and so forth. So what do we need to do now? So we want to create a empty string called longest string and set it to the most basic value of a string like that. So um, it's just an empty string. And from there because we have we now have an array of strings and we need to compare to see, if this longest string is less than anything in the array, we need to swap them. So this is what we'll do here. We'll do a for loop and we'll say for, create a uh, i counter to keep track of things, start at zero, and they'll say why i is less than array of strings dot length. So the length of the strings, the length of the array, excuse me, increment by one. And now what do we want to do? So we're going to run a for loop here. And from here, we want to run an if statement that says if um, longest string dot length is less than our array of strings. And don't forget the i. Uh, less than the array of strings on our current index value dot length less than the length of that we then are going to swap the words so we're gonna say longest string is equal to so if it's smaller in size we are gonna set it equal to array of strings and whatever the value is here now what else do we need to do? It looks like we just need to reset str here. So um, we're going to set str is equal to our longest string. So and then it's going to run this and it's going to find the longest one. Oh, and make sure you spell everything correctly. Array of strings. Array. And make sure you spell it correctly right here. There we go. So let's go ahead and put some comments in here real quick so that we, you know, it's fully explained. So um, create an array of strings breaking the words, uh, strings breaking up every space. Um, temporary placeholder for our longest string. Iterate through the array and compare longest string with current string. Cool. So run it. Go ahead and tweet it out if you're like me. I like to tweet. It helps them out. Probably helps me out. Um, submit. Go on to the next challenge. And we can submit our solutions at GitHub GS. But anyhow, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Title case a sentence. So uh, I don't remember what it means to title case, so I got to look that up. But as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. That helps me out a ton. And I appreciate all the comments that I get and all the questions I get in the comments. And I'm happy to answer them. So keep them coming. And I'll see you in the next video.